This has a 1 in 100,000 chance of happening. This has a 1 in 1 million chance of happening. This has a 1 in 1 billion chance of happening. That's just not possible. We're going to be reacting to the most improbable things that have ever happened. Being ambidextrous, 1 in 100 odds. I had a kid in my K5 class that was ambidextrous, and I thought it was so cool. 1 in 100 odds means only 1% of people can do this. Well, that would explain it, because I know that one kid, and I know about 99 other people, so that makes sense. Now we're going to jump up to 1 in 750 odds, which is having 12 fingers. What? That's genius to play guitar. Like, that would be really helpful. That's so cool. 1 in 750, that's a lot more people than I thought. Well, yeah. How many people in the world have 12 fingers? Seven and a half million. Wow. Whoa, 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 wait. That means there's 15 million extra fingers on the planet. <laughs> and they're just out there wiggling around. <laughs> All right, double egg yolk. Wait, okay, why was this guy recording himself with cracking eggs? Was he going for this? He knew. He knew. Double. Oh, he got the booby egg. Seeing a 360 rainbow, what does that even mean? Oh, that's what you that mean. It's basically like looking through a camera lens almost. That's crazy. It's like a little portal. That's how Dr. Strange be getting around raining. raining red rain what does that mean there's something very out of the ordinary about this rain it's blood red why tell us why, why is it red we need to know why this is no science fiction story okay okay it's weather right here on earth we get that what? they didn't even tell us wow no way, living to 100 is 1 in 3,700 odds. Wow, she looks good for 104. Hey, maybe you hit her up. She yeah, I mean, well, well, I have a girlfriend, but if I didn't. Uh, two doctors have told me that if I drink it, I will die. But they died first. Yo! Yo! Granny yeah. just popped off! Seeing a reverse tiger. <laughs> She's just walking tiger. backwards. <laughs> oh, it's it's like a black tiger with oh, orange wow. stripes instead of an orange tiger with black stripes. That's cool. Do you think like animals in the wild are like, whoa, he dripped out? Or do are they like different shun? Seeing how he was alone? Probably the ladder. I don't know why he'd need a ladder. He has claws to well, climb up trees. But he was struggling. Yeah. The ladder would have made it quicker. Uh, scoring a perfect bowling game. Wow, one in 11,000. Really? Okay. I think the higher odds are scoring a perfect bowling game and then going and getting a kiss from a female. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> yeah, it's just the shoes. Any sport that you can eat and you have to wear goofy ass shoes, you're, it's just, I'm not gonna take it serious, I'm sorry. Finding a giant- Amethyst. What's an amethyst? It's a gem. Oh, it's Logan Paul. Wait, you think he'll find a zoo in there? <laughs> Oh my God! Whoa, classic Logan Paul face. Oh my God, I haven't seen that in forever. Look at that, that face. That looks like one of our main channel thumbnails. But ours are ironic, so it's okay. Was that fake or was that real? It looked real, that is beautiful. There's a one in 25,000 chance that your cat gets four ears. Oh, I love it. I wonder if it does better in the wild. It would do better in my home. Why is your tongue out? Because it's not just enough for it to have four ears. It also has to just be like Bleh. Finding a puffy Dorito. How do you measure that this is one in 200,000? Uh, how do you measure what is a puffy Dorito? Like, how puffy does it have to be to be a puffy Dorito? Like, do you just open up 200,000 bags of Doritos and go, oh, that's how long it took to find one? And it just made this 13-year-old $20,000 richer. See, here's the difference between me and your average person. Wouldn't have thought twice. You would have ate it. Ate it so hey, quick. Guess. Here's what would have happened in my head. I would have been like, holy crap, this looks like it's going to taste better than normal. And guess what? What? That's why snacking hasn't made you 20 grand. It's fair. Flying through a lightning storm. Yeah, flying through a lightning storm something, but have you found a puffy Dorito? Pilots probably see that all the time. Is that what they actually see? I can't believe pilots actually have to deal with that. That's crazy. You know what's crazier? This package I got for Chris. Oh, sweet. It's finally here. What is it? Well, I don't know. I ordered a lot of stuff online. Oh, look. It's my official Furby. How many of those do you own? Hundreds. You should probably sell some of them. I'm sure they're worth money. And then I'll ship them. How do I sell them, Jimothy? Shopify, the sponsor of this video. What's Shopify? I just ship packages. Shopify offers an easy-to-use commerce platform that makes starting a business incredibly easy. So easy, in fact, that even Chris could do it. Yeah, and I'm stupid. It can even help you grow your business from selling one Furby a month to selling billions of Furbies a month with tools that are typically only available for giant businesses. Wow, better get to Furbin. Anyone can now create the business of their dreams using Shopify. Just click the link in the description or go to this URL right here, shopify.com slash MrBeast. Can I leave now? Two-headed lizard. Oh my gosh. What are the odds of this? One in 500,000. Oh. That is sick looking. Do you think they operate under the same belly and same like poo poo. Do you think one gets full when the other one eats? <laughs> He's like, yo, slow down. <laughs> I'm trying to enjoy this snack too. Fishing a blue lobster. I saw this on TikTok. I saw this on TikTok. What does he do at the end? Blue 
lobster fact! Lobsters can theoretically live indefinitely as long as they can keep molting their shell. Why am I not a lobster? Because you can't molt. Accent changing syndrome. Wait, Chris suffers from this. What? Lisa Alamia. Oh, I'm not from England, sorry. Is 100% Texan. She's no way. Hey, where are you from? I'm from Rosenberg. Oh, where's, where's that? I'm like, we're here in Rosenberg. Oh, you're from here. How'd you talk like that? I've never heard of this in my entire life. I don't have any earbuds in. <laughs> I, I can't hear anything. <laughs> raining in single spot. It was only raining in this one spot on the street and nowhere else in the city. That's Somebody's pouring something. Yeah, that's the cloud from yeah. cartoons when you're sad. Yeah, yeah this person filming should have just put the camera down and been like, oh. <gasps> Giving birth to nine twins? So nine twins, does that mean 18 kids or? She had nine kids at the same time? Someone look at that man. That man got something going on. You're the dad, you're just like. <laughs> that is wild. She passed all nine of those kids through her yeah. body. You nine think times. the doctor pulled around and said package delivery? That Could you like imagine it. if you had eight other Tuckers? Yeah, I'd be tired. <laughs> He'd be tuckered out. Finding buried treasure. One in 20, 250,000 million. A Northern California couple says they were- What's this deer have to do with it? February when they saw an old tin can poking out of the ground. This guy looks like he pokes old he tin cans. He does look like if you found a tin can, he'd be like, I gotta dig that No, out. grab a stick. Did you know that there's no uh, recorded proof that a pirate has ever buried treasure? Carl, shut up. No need to ruin our fun. I just deliver packages. <laughs> Finding a perfect doppelganger. One in 900 million odds. One wedding photographer got the surprise of his life when he met his doppelganger on a plane. That's crazy though. Look at that guy. He's like, ha! Ah! He's like, I'm a part of this. My name's Bill, I'm a, I was here. A friend of Neil's shared the doppelganger's picture on Twitter and it has been retweeted thousands of times. Whoa! Thousands of times. 6,000 times. He's breaking the internet. Winning the game show, who wants to be a millionaire? One in a billion, really. I like the call my parents right now. What well, nerd? I don't really need your help, but I just wanted to let you know that I'm gonna win the million dollars. <laughs> Richard Nixon, that's my final answer. He's won a million dollars! Whoa! Not only did he win a million dollars, he got that Riz! What a chat. This yeah. next person has 200 IQ. His IQ is so big he can't have sleeves on his shirt. <laughs> Most of us have an IQ of 100. 195 to 200. Well, you're talking one in several billion people. Oh, wow. I didn't know how rare I was. Yeah, same. That's crazy. That's 200. I have a 206, so that's wow. crazy. Wow. So basically everyone in the world with over 200 is in this room. Uh -huh. That's crazy, crazy, actually. Galileo, 185. Isaac Newton, 190. And Carl Jacobs. Langan could possibly be the smartest person in the world. And he uses that talent to pet horses. <laughs> Wait, I want you guys to look at this number. Perfect NCAA March Madness bracket. I'm not even gonna say that number. That's a lot of numbers. Nine lots of numbers odds. Did somebody do it? I had the best bracket out of 11.57 million people. What was your strategy for success? Well, I just filled out who I think is gonna win. <laughs> the secret to success is luck. Subscribe or you won't have any. And I'll ship them.